This location is where I shot my first film, Demon Idol. This four minute Super 8 film cost me $20 to make at the time. And with this wonderful dialogue it has. Who me? Yeah, you. As a filmmaker, when you have very little to work with, you gotta just make it work. And one of the most useful tools I found is the selfie monopod. I just love the selfie stick and definitely comes in handy for like all types of film situations. But I find this selfie monopod so useful that I use it in just about every shoot that I do. One thing I like about the selfie stick, fold it up, put it in your pocket, and then when you need it, mount the camera on it and then pull it out and you can start shooting. Add a little more flavor to your filmmaking, it's great. Especially when you live in New York, New York, they're very restrictive restricted in where you shoot. For example, in New York City subways, I could take a selfie monopod, get the shots I need, I can put the actor in the shot, and then just shoot the scene. Sometimes you might be able to get away with dialogue when you do that. I think that takes a little more planning. If you need your B-roll, this is the way I'd recommend to go. In my opinion, you know, you don't have to have fancy equipment. It's your content that makes your film, any film. One thing you could do with a selfie stick that I like is that, let's say if you don't have a cameraman, available to shoot some stuff for you you could just use a selfie stick and film yourself and that way you don't need a cameraman or anything to help you out now today they make cameras with stabilization which is fantastic and you'll get really smooth shots just with the stabilization but not a, it seems to be a standard in cameras i'm not sure about cell phones if they have stealth stabilization but i know it's probably around the corner that they do but not only can you use this to shoot in different places in case you don't have access to a tripod or to your production it's easy and basically doing some pan Hands. And of course you could use editing software to smooth out the shot. Okay, you kind of see how it looked. I'm doing a tracking shot. Doesn't look too bad. I'm just doing this on the fly. I mean, especially for a few bucks, you get some really nice shots with it. And it comes in handy, especially when you don't have a camera. I wish you good luck. And if you have any questions, just leave them on the bottom.